Welcome to Showstopper, powered by Equiratings. With one major championship complete for 2024, we thought we'd look towards the Olympics and see how French course designer Gregory Baudot's courses have measured up against the best in the world. The Frenchman has been building courses for over 28 years and prides himself on being a modern course designer who melds a safe and fair course that is also entertaining for the audience. This will be his first time building an Olympic Games, and on home turf, the pressure is sure to be mounting. He has said that he tries to build courses with the forward movement of the horse in mind and argues that a maximum of 25% should go clear in any given class, although for him, it's more about the specific grouping of horses and riders that makes for the most exciting sport. So let's take a look at some of his stats over the last year. The strongest five-star field strength Bodo built for was the World Cup in Basel with a field strength of 709, won by Peter DeVos and Tupi de la Roque on an ELO of 753. For context, the strongest field strength we saw in all of 2023 under any course designer was 758 and 747 in the Rolex Top 10 Final and Rolex Grand Prix in Geneva. So basically, that means Bodo built a course for one of the strongest groups of horses and riders we saw all year. Conversely, however, that same weekend, he built the Grand Prix in Basel with the lowest five-star field strength of 685, but produced a clear rate of only 10%. So perhaps you could deduct that he built it a little too strong for those entered in it. Every single major competition Bodo has built or assisted building this year has seen a winner with a very high ELO, proving that mastering one of his courses takes a consistent and top sport horse. It doesn't seem like a fluke winner will be in the cards come July. The average clear rate of any class Bodo has built so far this year is 17.6%, so a bit lower than his estimate of 25%, but to be honest, I would bet that that percentage is right in the sweet spot of what the crowd generally likes. He averaged 6.8 clear rounds per class, which if you ask me, is absolutely ideal for five-star show jumping. Jumpable, but clearly very challenging. I can say from personal experience that Bodo's courses are unique and truly stand out from the rest. He places jumps in unexpected places, he never overfaces the field, and he catches horses and riders out all over the course versus in one particular area. One of his strongest assets is his use of color and material when building a course in order to challenge the sight of the horses by creating optical illusions for, honestly, both the horse and the rider. It will be particularly fascinating to see what he builds come the Olympics, but you can be sure he is up to the challenge, and we will certainly see some difficult and entertaining sport.